Welcome to Chewing the Cud with Mike Benyon Rowe and Lee Robertson. I said you don't cry over spilt milk, but you can cry over spilt. Oh, hello. Welcome to Chewing the Cud. How are you doing this week, Lee? Fair to middling. Fair to middling, not middling. Middling, middling. 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 Mm, okay. mm. Well, this week we've been having a think about all the things we've done so far this year and thought, why not have a bit of a recap on some of our best bits, funny bits, and bits you don't get to see, like this one here. My shits have been proper loose since I started drinking these tea bags. Oh, I've just done one. <laughs> you do know we're still recording, right? Yeah. Okay, just checking you're aware. <laughs> right. So, now... Of a, of a, of a very, very... Dear friend? <laughs> a very, very dear celebrity. Okay, just cut to me for a second. Just say dear, dear celebrity. A very dear celebrity. Okay. Well... On screen now, you can see all the ways of getting hold of us. It's at the Could TV on social media, where you can follow us. Uh. Keep going. Is that good? Is that good for you? Good for me. Um, I can't say things that that Lee wants me to say. On screen now, you can see all the ways of getting hold of us. It's at the Good TV on social media, where you can follow us, good.tv for our website, and on YouTube or podcast services, look for Chewing the Cud and hit subscribe. Oh no, we needed the cut bit. We needed Lee to go, a dear celebrity I needed to throw. I thought you just wanted me to do, do it as level, sorry. <laughs> Forgive me for not being... <laughs> <laughs> Constantly erect, or <all> the... <laughs> like kneading dough. <laughs> Did you seriously just say you flick his clit, Paul? I thought he said lick his clit, and that was where I was drawing the line. <laughs> Give it a flick. Yeah, punch it if you want. <laughs> like a punched lasagna, like a drop lasagna. <laughs> Fork. <laughs> I'm fingered by his beautiful wife. Okay, that's one? Yes. <laughs> 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 it's clearly tickled both Mike and the gallery. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. <All> right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come on. <coughs> wow. Did I sing it? Have I sung it before? Oh! oh. <laughs> I'd still like to hear it though, Mike. Come on, shall I sing it with you? Shall I sing it with you? Oh! No way to control it. Totally automatic. <laughs> I, I do believe <laughs> that is automatic by the Pointer Sisters. I love it, yeah. I love it. Ah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear Lord. <laughs> that shouldn't have been that funny. Okay, I might be tired. Ah. Uh. When you're ready, Mike. Oh, you're gonna have to wait a bit. I just need to compose myself. Ah. Uh. Oh. 
<laughs> no. <laughs> no. <sighs> Tell you, those toilets are getting a lot of action today. Oh, that was a little long one. Right. Oh. Oh, it's a little bit. This is not how. I lost my play hat, though. Right. So, from the relatively serious mm -hmm. to the ridiculous. Okay. So. Let's talk about that top then. <laughs> <laughs> All right, James Martin, with your jingle jangle jewellery from Timu. Mm, we know what you've done. We can see. <laughs> <laughs> we know what you've done. We, we can, can see. Oh, where is that we from? We can see where you've been shopping. This necklace is from where exactly? It's from a very fashionable emporium. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this is not... This is not <laughs> Claire's accessories, the <laughs> earrings I've stuck together. <laughs> this is nothing to do with showbiz. No. Um, and then the door open again. You're watching Chewing the Cod. This week. This week. You're watching Chewing the Cod. This. No. No. You're watching Chewing the Cod. This week we're going to play Gobby Game Show. Doors are open. Do I have to say it again? How many times? Four. What's a part? <sighs> You're watching Chewing the Cud. On a side note, you may hear... <laughs> you may hear the sound of somebody angry f***ing a llama outside. Don't worry. Just my dad. <laughs> my dad. <laughs> oh dear. <clears throat> you had too much sugar then. <laughs> <laughs> Hit me, you got like a ton of bricks. You're watching Chewing the Cod. Just to let you know, our back doors are very uh, gaping wide this, uh, today in the studio, and we've got visitors just coming to have a look. So you may hear the screeching of my soul as it's tortured. Or. Um, and then schmock, and then Coat. that is um, that is Nicki Minaj and um, um, Kim. Kim Petris yeah. in the video for for um, their latest single, which has a sample of the thunder. Have you just followed through? What's going on? Don't know. I've got um, gallery. Just as a heads up, um, I lost you about five minutes ago on a, on the ear because my battery's dead. So, um, if you said anything insightful. They said that I was the better presenter. It's still recording, I'll be able to hear it later, don't worry. <laughs> and it just should be my show. But you know. <laughs> Can you just stop dragging your f***ing furniture across the floor? For just ten minutes? What red light? The, the, the on air light is on. Oh. We're too busy sorting up. We've got half an hour. Oh. I've no idea what this is. He's saying. no idea because so his battery's the flat. Dead, so I'll, I'll swap it over in a minute because we've got five minutes. Do you want to plug it into a wire, baby? I, I will, but we've got, we'll get through this five minutes and then I'll, I'll steal Lee's cable from there and oh, okay. turn it over. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm glad he's dead, just so he didn't have to witness that. Oh, uh, rock and pop. Well, if he wasn't, that, that performance would have killed him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Which indie rock band had a 2004 hit with Take Me Out? I don't My know. My sentiment exactly right now. Um, I know you don't know whether to suck or blow. I want you... To take me out. Do, 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 do,
<laughs> you don't know the suit at all, do you? I know. I kind of know who the band are, Is but it I the don't killers? know. Them. No, it was um, it was Franz Ferdinand. Franz Ferdinand. It was one of that type of people. But yeah, that's. But talking about taking you out, I think that's enough for now. Talking about taking people out, oh, I think that's enough for now. So stick around because coming up next. Bit... <laughs> Welcome back to Chewing the Cud. This is our look at the things we've been up to, a retrospective almost. How have you enjoyed it so far? I cannot contain myself. It's been hilarious. <laughs> I cannot contain <laughs> myself. It's the, been hilarious. Just to let the viewers know, this is actual AI. I am not here. Oh, okay. I am in another place. Is and it another a time. Place? Yes. Okay. Well, um, shall we look at some more bits? Yes. That was dramatic for you. Christina Aguilera, as well you know. <laughs> And a star vagina. <laughs> a spiky vagina. <laughs> uh, we'll go for rock. I don't, I don't want to do another soundtrack. Which song contains the lyric, I'm happy, I hope you're happy too? I'm happy, I hope you're happy too. That's my impression of the song. Is that what it goes like? Yeah, it does actually. That's quite good. I'm happy, I hope you're happy too. No idea. I really don't have a clue. Really? Ashes to Ashes by David Bowie. No. That's Ashes not how that song goes. Yes, it is. Ashes to Ashes. Really is when you go on holiday, Paul, do you wear a, do you wear um, do you wear a thong or do you wear um, do you wear speedos? You see his complexion, like he goes out in the sun. <laughs> Ask Dean. <laughs> knickerbockers. <laughs> I can see you in knickerbockers, Dean. See one of those. those... I can see. I can see Paul eating a knickerbocker glory. Yeah. It's like <laughs> one of those kind of like metal helmeted diving suits. Diving bell. Yeah. From Scooby Doo. Yeah. Oh, the Meg 2's out. Oh, I'm going to go see that next week. I love those crap films. Yes. <laughs> it is about Meghan Markle. Jason Statham just grunting and there's a massive <laughs> CGI shark that eats people. And this one's got dinosaurs in it. I'm ready. I'm ready. Coming back over? Oh, don't, Paul. Don't. What did he say? He made the same joke he makes all the time, but it's, it's yeah. You wouldn't. Oh, yeah, because it's not, this isn't happening again. <laughs> you wouldn't laugh your ass off, Paul. Just, yeah. It's been a grueler today, Mike. Huh? It's been a grueler today. That has. Being going to change his nappy. He can sneeze in public and not worry. <laughs> Dean sent me a clip of a, of a guy who, uh, well, he's, you know Martin Short, the actor? Uh -huh. Well, he did this character, I've never heard of this character in America where he kind of is this really sort of offensive interviewer of famous people. And it's hilarious. And one of them is he's kind of saying to somebody, you were a nappy? You wanted your stinky? And they end up just going, like looking at him, it's hilarious. 
We think it's really funny. Must be an age thing. He <laughs> do, <laughs> yeah. Anti-Semitic, racist. He's a Jew himself, so it's okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. That was his what's his face, the one that did blazing saddles. Mel Gibson. <laughs> Mel Gedroid. <laughs> sat, anyway. there, sat there in Leopard Brink going, Oh Jewish bastards. Just just as Rob were dying battery packs, so we just move on. <laughs> Well, that's the choice that's happened there. To be fair, I thought there was going to be a rage and I was going to destroy the entire you set. There was going to be a rage. Because I didn't there think was, it was going to there assemble. Several rages, there were several rages. Yeah. But it is, it is assembled now. It is. And um, for Pride season, just in time for all, for all. It's not quite sturdy. That's quite sturdy. I'm not going to tug on mine because <laughs> it'll fall to pieces and I don't You've not said happy. that before. Because <laughs> I don't want it to fall. You're watching Jew in the Cud and we're here in Malaysia. I hope you're enjoying yourself. Let's have a look at a bit more of what we're up to. Stick around. We've got more Chew in the Cud coming after this. You know what I need to do? Sort my trousers out. Because I'm showing more crack than a drug dealer on a sales expedition. I'm still recording, sorry. <laughs> I didn't watch their careers. They wouldn't be able to have. Well, yeah, they said. Well, Ant apparently said we owe such a lot to Biker Grove and the North East. Um, is, is your light on you? Yeah, well, you were there filming. I don't give a shit. <laughs> it's a problem with an open door policy. The gallery can get up. <laughs> is your light? Your light's not on you, is it? I don't know. I can't because I look at the light and now I see stop dots. So, security. There's a human thumb walked into the studio. <laughs> No, it's a sprout. <laughs> You've got a scar on your chin. I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, he was one of those children, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. In mini motorbikes up and down the estates. That's the one he's messing with, because I look up and it, it blinds me. Just, so. just wave in front of it so I can see the shadow. Okay. Too far that side. You, you need to put some more into it. Give it a bit of... Has um. it turned up on the back? Yeah. Is I ain't got any more to give. Stop being so pale, he said. So I've worked on skin cancer, so I'm not as pale, and now I'm too... I'm not... what it is. Dean, are you sure it's not the F stop? No. I haven't got any more to give. Is it give. too hot? Don't go G, that's a hot. number of layers is gone for <laughs> Padam. <damn. laughs> so what, To watch the show. We're just going to have to have a slight pause. Don't we can stop the clock. Are you going to shit yourself? Yes. Oh my God. Oh. Get the tarpaulin out. New tablets. And they have a side effect. How long? You know, if you're a professional, you'd, you'd close those sphincter muscles until it was... Uh... <laughs> he doesn't have control. Don't be surprised on your 57th birthday, Dean. If, if, I, if I phone the airport and tell them that there's a terrorist or... Travelling under the name of Dean Roughly. Because I didn't take my earpiece out, you bunch of cog... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it has got range. But yeah. It flew out to me, it did. 
very drippy. Mike was concerned that if Lee said something remotely funny, unlikely, but possible, um, he would laugh and shit himself. <laughs> was where he was at, and that's why he went, I better go Has Dean not got any of his adult nappies lying around downstairs? Oh. I'm all right, thanks, Dean. I can, I can control it to an extent. Well, we know that's a lie. I can control it to an extent. I didn't shit myself. <laughs> Just... Yeah. Well, Dean eats his crisps. And Paul eats something out of a bowl. Okay. You're watching Chewing the Cud. Watching other bits and good bits and bits that are funny. And all that kind of stuff. Did you like? Do you like that? Do you like to see where you make the mistakes? <laughs> all of the mistakes. Mm. That's better than some people singing, I suppose. I never, I never sing on this show ever. Have you just shown a clip of me singing? Next one. Yes. Another Channel Four stalwart TV show. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven felines. The number after seven is. There's lots of numbers after seven. What's the no what is it? What is the next number after seven? You mean eight out of ten cats? Yes. I find that program really boring. I find it irritating for two reasons. Both are Jimmy Carr. No, one's Jimmy Carr. <laughs> and <laughs> it's not even that. It's just the fact I don't find him particularly. Funny. No, he's smoggy smug, smug, isn't he? Uh, uh, mm. But it's the um, the people, the countdown boys that they have on, oh. and the tight pants and the big muscles. Oh, okay. Because All right, they're then. never naked, or in my oh, head. Oh, well, sad times for you. Yeah. Okay, this 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 television show is inexplicably popular, where they put during the cud. <laughs> no, they put a a group of hideously deformed Love Island. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, okay. This is this has been going on for quite a few years. Apocalypse. Um, now. Um, walking around, hello, I'm a, I'm a policeman. Um, where, why is everybody dead and eating each other? And then they go to a prison and then you go somewhere else and just loads of people just get eaten by zombies all the time. Night out in Dean's Gate. An hour in Dean's Gate. A night out in Dean's Gate. Night in Dean's Gate, no. Andrew Lincoln plays the main character. Yeah. Who's, who's he? Who's he? Yeah. He's, yeah. he's a very, very well-known English actor. Not that well-known. He was in This Life back in the day. What else has he been in? I don't know. This programme that I'm talking about now. What's the name of that? Yeah. No. No, no idea. No, The Walking Dead. Oh, right, OK. Didn't watch it. Did you know, I didn't really watch it. No. No. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and we'll see you all soon. Bye. Bye. Let me see yours. Don't you touch it. I know you're going to break I it. I won't break it, I promise. If you break it, I'll kill you. <gasps> <laughs> you struck me. Good, because that took me <laughs> ages to get that on. It did. Can't <laughs> Get your red daddy at the chip Get shop. Da Daddy's getting hot at the chippy shop, <laughs> eating sausage and peas. He's having a chippy tea. She's at home with the dripping butty. <laughs> <laughs> there we are. No pee wet for him. Don't thought the Does the table come towards me? Or does no. It? no. Don't, see the table. Don't move the table. Don't see the table in this one. Oh, okay. <sighs> It is, Dean. It is more comfortable. As long as you don't move the chair, it's fine. I'm not moving, I'm not moving the chair. Right. You. Yeah. I'm going to kill you. What is? The chair is slightly off-centre. What? 
You're slightly off centre. That's better. <laughs> Sit in the you and your, the sim your symmetry, it's a right issue, isn't it? <laughs> My bone's quite symmetrical. You couldn't lie symmetrical if we stapled you to the floor. One, two, three. Because that's helpful, isn't it? Camera's there, remember? Camera, are ah, yeah. Right. Hi, you're watching Chew in the Cud, and I'm here in Borneo. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Oh, too much headroom. Not enough headroom. Too much head. Hi, you're watching Chew in the Cud, and we're still here in Borneo. Now, not with the amount of you here. <laughs> not with the amount of dressing you pour on it. I've got into Caesar salads at the minute. Are you? Yeah, make my own dressing for that though. Then I can make it a light one. Okay. Nice. But yeah, Caesar just... salad with, with anchovies and walnuts, which technically makes it a Waldorf salad, but. Gross. It's really gross. Anchovies, gross. Oh, tasty. Little salty fish. No. Nom, 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 nom. I get George staring at me the entire time I'm eating it. And then he tries to eat my breath afterwards when I'm breathing and he goes... <coughs> he I don't know choice. what's going on. He's wittering on about something <laughs> and you're going on about clips. Just film this <laughs> thing, please. I want to go home. <laughs> Sugar no love we. <laughs> It's not coloured it, so how am I supposed to know? Right, wind it down then. That's it, and then we get... Okay. And then we get all scientific, in that science that is. But on screen now, you can see our contact media. Oh, <laughs> off you <c> <laughs> <laughs> Our contact media, f*** <laughs> you <c> Hold <laughs> oh, one second. You are welcome. <sighs> <laughs> And then we get all scientific in that science that is. But on screen now, you can see our social media contact. Problems. And then we get all scientific in that science that is. But on screen now, you can see our social media contact details. Just look for at the cook TV. <laughs> 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 I could see you getting ready to go through the whole spiel as well. Because he wants to go home, he's like, ah! <laughs> I'm just going to pop on the air conditioning for a moment. <laughs> and then we get all scientific with that science that is. But on screen now, you can see our social media contact info. Just look for at the Cud TV. And there's the names. Oh, it's you, that, isn't it? Yeah. Piss stains. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Lee shows us all his trousers. <laughs> and there's the names of people who have dropped us a line on the old Tinto. I've done that before. And as people who've contacted us go along the bottom of the screen, we go over to Lee and the showbiz news. He was born in the Wirral, Birkenhead, in 1955. OK. Where's the website? You told me to log on to a website. Where is it? It is... I don't know, Mike. OK. I'm sure if you just typed in... Half a story to a Lee. Google search, <laughs> Paul O'Grady statue, that's uh -huh. the thing that comes up first. OK. Yeah. So there we go. Do you think there'll be a statue of me? You want to be stuffed anyway. <laughs> You've always said when you die you want to be like, gutted and, and stuffed, so you're always there. I'd like a statue as well. I will get you a, a, a great likeness like the one of Victoria Wood. I was just going to say, not like the Victoria Wood one, thank you. 
Well, that's the end of this week's showbiz news. <laughs> what do you mean, oh dear? I have very, very limited lung capacity. <laughs> I thought you might say slim lungs then. <laughs> well, yeah, that as well. Rude. <laughs> I have very slim lungs. <laughs> they disappear if I turn sideways. <laughs> Not saying anything because you'll beat me. Um. And as people who have s spunked on my face, <laughs> it's not about to say people that. who have spunked on my face, <laughs> <laughs> and as people, <laughs> no names got across the board. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tumbleweed. <clears throat> Just a dog. <laughs> it's funny because it's true. It is. It's not hand cream. What is it? It's aftershave balm. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. It smells good though, doesn't it? It only releases its odour when you when it's applied to the skin. It's nice though, isn't it? Yeah. What is it, Mike? What have you filled what have you filled that up with? Spunk. Is it your man juice? It is spunk. Like my man juice is that white. How good do you think my diet is? Welcome back to Chewing the Cud. So, we, we've been having a bit of a look at the, some of the mistakes we make and some of the fun times and some of the best bits. Mm. Have you got a best bit that sticks out in your mind at all? Not a single one. It's also, also good. The, 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 everyone yeah. a gem. Everyone a gem. Everyone could be put in a necklace and worn around the neck of a famous person. <laughs> you were about to say porn star then, weren't you? <laughs> <laughs> around the cock of a famous porn star. Exactly. Well. Let's watch some more. Sorry again, Dean. I'm not sorry. Did it on purpose. Ah, oh, words. Hi, that's shit headroom. <laughs> Hi, here we are at the fuck. Time pressure. Yeah, yeah, time yeah. Pressure. Just yeah. Hi, here we are at the National Palace of Malaysia. Ooh, King lives there. Like ours, but nicer. Lots of gold, Islamic design, very pretty. Big place, big place. Very open place. A bit of don't worry. Someone just sent me a picture on Grinder. Of their dingaling. It's it's worse than that. Is it a bum hole? It's worse than that. Is it a dirty bum hole? That's a child's toy. Oh. <laughs> no, well, it could be a dog toy. That's not any better. Karaoke. <laughs> you, you, you mockingly talk about the size of my car, and it's quite small. Um, but you get more space in my car because it's not filled with Care Bears. Unlike some people. I don't, I'm don't. i fully on board with that, I accept. I know you are, because your car is nothing but Care Bears. I do believe... 20 miles an hour down the boat. But your... I mean, if we're, if, we're, if, we're, if, we're, if, we're, if we're spilling the tea, then I do believe your car could well be considered a little skip on wheels. I it have is. looked into the passenger side of your car, and it's, it is not good. That's because the guy that used to clean it for me um, committed Sorry. suicide, and I've not had the ability to get around and clean it myself. You want to drop the S bomb, do you? Wow. Yeah. Did he? Did he? Did he? Did he do that because of your car? No, I used to give him a lift to work, um, and the, the deal was because he couldn't afford to pay me petrol money, he would clean my car once every other week instead of giving me petrol money. So it's so it, so. You're, what you're saying is is that the cesspit that is the inside of your car is a tribute. No, it's because he was selfish enough to kill himself. Wow. My car is now no longer cleaned. That's Mike, spokesman for Suicide Anonymous. <laughs> Let's look. Celebrities, they're talking about being sexy at the moment. Do they know it? No, they, they know it. Oh. They're talking all about it. So we're going to explore a little bit of that today. Oh. First up, we've got Christina Aguilera. Who? Christina Aguilera. What oh, did I say? I don't know what I said first. Sure I'm not quite sure. I don't know who that was. Stroke.
And as the people who have popped up on our social media, no, 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 no. Oh, titty thee not. And as the people, no, <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like say saying that. Different. I'm going to say something different. This is the, the toiletry bag that you get on first class at Emirates. You stole that as well. No, got given. There is a bit. Is there anything else? You, could, you, could, you, could you have fitted like a blanket or anything in there that, that was going in the Didn't plane? get blankets, got duvets. Duvet? Got a proper fucking duvet. My goodness. Eight tog it was. Oh. Because it's, you know, it's already warm on the plane and stuff. Could you not? Could, I tried. You not. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to get it in my case, it, in my bag, but it was already full with other you stuff. You see, they wouldn't use them if they didn't expect people to take them. That's what I said. That's that's the whole point, isn't it? That's what I said to Phil. <laughs> oh, and he like, looked over and went, what are you doing? I'm like, going, just seeing if I could fit this Kind of fit the seat inside my uh, case. <laughs> We've got three minutes of filling. Let's can do that. No. Yeah. Are there any animals in the canopy? Parrots? Some birds. Um, um, hornbills. And a lot of hornbills. 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 Did, <laughs> did they make, make you feel welcome in Bornaho? Bornaho? Yeah. It's quite a lump <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was where you were going. Two different episodes. Two different yeah. things. Okay, well, not. We'll cut that. That's, no, I'll cut that out in post. Cut that out. I'll do yeah, that in post. Cut it out. Okay, yeah. yeah. Did, did they make you feel welcome in Kuala Lumpur? Yes, um, actually, very welcoming. Very, very accommodating. Which was always good. No, that would be me. Happy now. <laughs> Next to just be sat naked with a with a mic clamped onto his nipple. That's that's the next episode. <laughs> um, Can we put the time back to eight minutes, please? Just because we kept going a couple of times. So. Oh, I love a hot stone. Ooh. Um, I've had. Ooh. I had once. Don't mind expanding socks. <laughs> <laughs> I was once. Fisted by a goat. No, I was once regressed. But into what? Into another, into a, into a past life. And how did that work for you? Not very, not so well. <laughs> what we, oh, we found you were a past life, you were a snail. <laughs> no, because no, I, no, I don't, no, I don't no, think it worked. Okay. But I felt bad, so I invented something. Because <laughs> what if that's what everybody does? If everybody does, then that person thinks that they're amazing. But or it's they really know, all... they know that it's no good. And they know that everyone's going to lie. They just let you go on. Yeah. But, like, you've got your eyes closed. And it's like, oh, I, oh, oh yeah. I'm Cleopatra. Of course you are, love. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I think she was quite... I was like, yes. Did yes. you do voices and everything? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But you don't poo-poo it. Because it could, <laughs> could be true. It could be true. Could the be fact true. that you had to play along <laughs> and paid for the privilege yeah. of doing some improv. By a substantial amount of money. Um, How much? D three digits. No, it wasn't three digits. Goodness okay. gracious me. Uh, it was about 60 quid. Stop. But that was for uh. a regression. <laughs> um, Reiki. Ooh. Okay. And tarot cards. And miming as well. <laughs> That's the only bit that stuck. Um, <laughs> it's mm. that a dance you used to do in the clubs? Feed the Feeding the chickens. <laughs> um, she wasn't very accurate. Because she said that somebody with an eye infection would give me a very important piece of information. And I don't know where this person... Don't, it could have been any... What? It's not an eye infection up here. It's like, I've given you uh, something. That's some important information. For about here. a year, I kept looking at people and going, <laughs> is it you? <laughs> I was waiting for just somebody to say, yeah. Okay. So, you know, yeah. <laughs> is there a death grip? There is a death grip. It's just there, and you just squeeze really hard for a long period of time. No, there's a thing, can't it? Minimum, 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 
there's an immobilizing grip. It's not like that. Not like that. <laughs> so you're immobilizing a mouse. <laughs> um, a squish. There is a thing that you can do, isn't there, that, that, that is teaching self defense. That, anyway. You just jab into people's throat. <laughs> just that, direct into the throat. <laughs> yeah, like that. You don't have to make the noise. You do. You don't. It's a law. Okay. And as the names who have popped up and gone, I love, go along the bottom of the screen, it's Scream. Ah! <laughs> it's Mike Woodley. What, eh? And as names of... Um, and of... And as names of people... <laughs> hey. Hiya. Is my contour ring distracting you? <laughs> Got, just just got the cheese on these cheeseburgers. <laughs> just the 50 layers of makeup. <laughs> and finishing spray. Oh, it's <laughs> ashy blonde. <laughs> I've not really put on weight, Mike. It's just all the makeup. <laughs> <laughs> and there's names of people who have popped up and said, I love, go on the bottom of the screen. Scream again. <laughs> Oh. We'll get it right this time. When I say we, I mean me. This is still part four, but... Well, that's all for this week, so thanks for watching. It was so special we may have to do it again. Oh, bye.